Hello everyone, my name is Robert from Digital Storm. Today, I'm going to be showing you our Slade line of systems. The Slade is purpose-built to deliver an incredible amount of performance while maintaining a very silent profile. If you're looking for a system that is powerful, professional, and above all else is going to be quiet, you'll definitely want to check the Slade out. Now our Slades come in a black Corsair 550D chassis. This chassis features a thick, high quality brushed aluminum front panel. This not only gives the system a clean visual aesthetic, it also helps to further reduce system noise. The front panel can open on either the right or the left side, or can be taken off altogether. So with the front panel removed, if I flip this over, you can see there's a lot of nice foam on the inside of this panel. Now this is going to help to absorb any ambient noise coming from the front of the system. While we're on the subject of noise reduction, there's another feature I'd like to show you. If I press here, this panel comes off. There's more sound absorbing foam on the back of this panel as well. Removing this gives us access to the front fans, which pull in cooled air from these recessed side vents. This will keep the system running nice and cool. There's also another innovative feature up front that I'd like to show you. So this is a removable dust filter. Now this is held in place with magnets, so it's going to be very easy to take off and to put back on whenever you're cleaning the system. This is a nice feature. It's gonna help keep a lot of the dust from ever getting into your computer. So that means the computer is going to run cooler and quieter. So as you can see on this system, we don't actually have a windowed side panel. This is to help further reduce any ambient noise from inside of the chassis. What we do have is this large rectangular panel here. So if I press here, this panel comes off. I have more sound dampening material on the back side of this panel. With this panel out of the way, you can see I have room for two optional 120 or 140 millimeter fans that are covered with the same removable dust filter assembly that we found on the front of the system. So the nice thing with this case, the side panel is very easy to take off. If I press this button up here, the side panel comes out, I lift up gently, and it easily comes off. If I flip the panel around, you can see I have a lot of nice sound dampening material on the back side of the panel here. Now this is going to help to reduce any ambient noise from getting out of the system. So let me set this down real quick. And I'd like to show you inside of the system. As we move into the case, the noise dampening features continue. We have foam contact points for the case side panels that help to eliminate any vibrational noises. We also have foam lined mounting holes for the power supply and large rubber case feet to further help eliminate noise and vibration. There is also a removable dust filter along the bottom of the chassis to help protect the power supply from unwanted dust intrusion. This system features room for six hard drives. Each hard drive bay is removable and has rubber contact points to help further reduce any vibrational noises. We have a lot of room inside of the system for expandability and upgradability. On this computer here, I have a GTX 670 installed. Now this is a medium sized video card, but I still have plenty of room for either a larger card or to make this multiple cards should I want to go SLI or Crossfire sometime in the future. Another simple nice feature I like pointing out. We have these nice rubber grommeted cable management holes on this computer. These are going to be a simple clean way to keep wires out of the way and make sure that your airflow is unobstructed. On the subject of airflow, we have two 120 millimeter fans on the front. We also have two 120 millimeter fans and a 120 mil radiator on the back, or two 120 mil fans and a 240 mil radiator up on top with a 120 mil fan on the back. So as you can see, the system doesn't just have a lot of great features to help reduce noise. It's also going to be a very versatile chassis to own for many years to come. So to round out our features on this chassis, I'd like to take you all up top. If I press here, this panel comes off. I have more foam on the back side of this panel. I also have another magnetic removable dust filter. Now this is going to be either for optional fans or for any of our systems that are equipped with a 240 millimeter radiator. On the front of the system, we have our microphone port, headphone port, reset button, power button, and two USB 3.0s. So that pretty much wraps up my review of all of the hardware features on these computers. I actually have a monitor hooked up right behind us. I'd like to take you all over and show you that even with all the noise suppression features we have on this computer, we're not gonna have any issues with airflow or thermals. Let me show you. So I have ADA64 loaded up on this computer here. Now this is an intensive stress test that we use on all of our computers, and it's going to run all four cores or all the available cores on the system to 100%. So in this case, I actually have a graph right here. And if you look at the top right corner of the graph, all four of the, the uh, items for CPU percentage load are up to 100%. So this is going to run it as hard as you're ever gonna run it in either a game or rendering like in Premiere, After Effects, or on a program like Maya. So even with this running now for about 45 or 50 minutes, 
I'm not having any issues with temperatures. I've actually been monitoring it in hardware monitor. So if we look over here, the max recorded temperatures I have for CPU on core zero are 64C, core two or core one, 68C, core two, 66C, core three, 63C, and for package, I have an overall of 71C. So I've been running this for a while now. The fans haven't kicked up. It's not gotten any louder. And I also haven't had any issues with temperatures. So whether you're gaming, you're rendering on this, you're not gonna have any concerns with those issues. It's just gonna run like it should. So that pretty much wraps up my review of our Slade line of computers. If there's anything I didn't cover, any questions you have, or anything you'd like to know, just go ahead, give us a call or shoot us an email, and we'll be happy to help.